video SLC students target 80 out of 80 welcome to my channel then stop subject social in this session I am going to give one marks questions with solutions already I posted MCQ questions in this video I am going to give 81 very important questions most probably askable in the examination first question who was established Indian National Congress in India answer a o hume second who was the first time critically analyzed the ill effects of the british rule in india answer the moderates third who explained about the transfer of indian wealth to england in the name of drain theory answer dada by naroji fourth viceroy lord curzon declared partition of bengal in 1905 why answer because Bengal was the center of protest and anti-British sentiments. Fifth one, Swaraj my birthright and I will get it at any cost. Declared by whom? Answer, Lokamanya Balagangadhar Tilak. Sixth question, who was the young lady joined with Jadonath to fight against the British in northeastern part of India? Answer, Gaijin Liu. Seventh question, who wrote Geeta Rahasya in jail. Answer Balaganga Dattilak. The eighth question Who was the prominent leader of among the revolutionaries? Answer Arbindo Ghosh. Question number nine Dr. Haralu was awarded with Kaiser E. Hind by the British. Why? Answer He gave secret information against Gaiden Lu to the British officer MacDonald as a traitor. Question number 10. Which was the main political weapon of Gandhiji? Answer Satyagraha. Question number 11. Who was published the newspaper Young India? Answer Gandhiji. Question number 12. Which commission appointed for inquiry into the Jalinwal Bhag tragedy? Answer Hunter Commission. 13th question. Which region witnessed widespread protest against Rowalt Act in 1919? Answer the Punjab. From the next chapter, India after independence. Question number one. Which amendment of our constitution of India referred to secular and socialist? Answer 42nd amendment. Question number two. Who was who the who was the chair? Sorry. Who the Adila, who was the Alina, who was the chairman of the Constitution Drafting Committee? committee? Answer Dr. B. R. Ambedkar. Then question number three, who was the last Governor General of the India? Lord Mountbatten. Fourth question, who was the first President of India? Babu Rajendra Prasad. Question number five, which policy and system the Government of India followed and independent? Answer non alignment and parliamentary democracy. Question number six Who was the first Home Minister and Iron Man of India? Answer Sardar Pallavabhai Patel. Then seventh one Who were the real army of the Nizam of Hyderabad in India? Answer Razakar. Now from the political science, chapter challenges of India and their remedies. First question. When was Sarva Shikshana Abhiyana has been launched in India? Answer in 2001. Second question. Which article referred in our constitution for education is made as fundamental right? Answer article 21a. Then question number 9. What is mean by profiteering? Answer it means the excess profit earning trend at the cost of general public or consumers. Fourth question, what is mean communalism? Answer, it refers to the strong feeling that their group identities and interests are opposed to each other. Or even you can write like this, it creates religious division of society resulting in mutual distrust and threat. Fifth question, what is the meaning of regionalism? Answer, the strong feeling of people in favor of the local area in which they live. Sixth question, define the meaning of corruption. It means an inducement to do wrong 
by bribery or other unlawful means from the next chapter world challenges and india's role first question when was declared international human rights by world organization 10th december 1948 question number 2 this world in arms is not spending money alone it is spending the sweat of its laborers genius of its scientists and the hopes of its children stated by whom aisen r the answer question number 3 which were the dipolar countries in the world answer america black and russia black now let's see one more question from the sociology from the chapter social challenges first question define the meaning of female feticide answer the fetus is that of a girl and the parent do not want a girl baby to be born they kill it in the womb itself second which article of the constitution of india declares that employing children below 14 years for work is cognizable offence so answer article 24 question number 3 when child labor prohibition act was came into force in india in 1986 when ch- when child marriage prohibition act was came into force in india question number 4 answer in 2006 question number 5 what is mean dowry answer any kind of property jewelry or gift given to the bridegroom at the time of marriage either before or after marriage is known as dowry then question number 6 when prohibition of dowry act was came into force in india in 1961 seventh question what is mean female infanticide answer the inhuman practice of killing the female baby after it is born eighth question when was launched the national child labor project in india answer in 1982 this question is asked as a mcq question in march april 2023 ninth one when was right to education act rte came to force answer in 2009 tenth question the union government implemented a national policy in 1987 why answer because for the welfare of child laborers question number 11 when was launched a project for child laborers welfare in india answer in 1988 question number 12 when was the central government brought into force the child labor eradication and rehabilitation act that is in 2006 now from the geography part chapter india mineral and power resources question number 1 give any two examples of conventional resources answer coal petroleum natural gas etc second question which is ferro alloyed ores mined in india answer manganese third which is the wonder metal of the 20th century answer aluminium fourth today mica export reduced why answer because of the availability of substitute for mica question number 5 which mineral considered as a black diamond answer coal sixth which are the power resource known as liquid gold answer petroleum seventh question give any two examples of renewable non renewable sources answer solar energy wind energy tidal energy and biogas etc from the next chapter india transport and communication first one expand the gis geographical information system is the answer second which is the highest road in the world answer kulu manali and leh third expand the gps answer global positioning system fourth expand the rst answer remote sensing technology question number 5 when the indian government was established national highway authority of india answer in 
Sixth question: When the Indian government was established, Airport Authority of India. Answer in 1955. Seventh question: What is meant GIS? Answer: It collects the information, accumulate and enable us when required, modify and show the data of Earth's surface. Eighth question: Define the meaning of GPS. Answer: It works based on the information sent by the satellite and through the use of any individuals receiver set on the earth surface ninth question what is meant rst it gathers information about distance without physical physically touching the objects aerial and satellite photos from the remote sensing from economics chapter public finance and budget first question note the financial year of india Answer from April first and ends on thirty first March second. What is the meaning of budget? Answer the statement of estimated income and expenditure of a year prepared by the government is called budget. Third, in India, the central budget is prepared by whom? Answer the finance minister. Fourth, where will first submit the central budget of India? Answer in Lok Sabha. Fifth question: Write the formula of fiscal deficit, that is revenue receipts plus non-debt capital receipts, then total expenditure. Sixth question: What is meaning of surplus budget? Answer: If the budget shows excess income as compared to expenditure, it is called surplus budget. Seventh one: What is the meaning of deficit budget? Answer: If the expenditure is more than the income, it is called deficit budget. Eighth one: What is the meaning of balanced budget? Answer: If both income and expenditure are the same, it is called balanced budget. Question number nine: What is the meaning of public expenditure? Answer: The government spends money for various purposes. Like defence, administration, economic development, and welfare of the people, it is called public expenditure. Tenth one, what is the meaning of revenue expenditure? The expenditure incurred in by the central government from the source of revenue income is called revenue expenditure. And uh, question number eleven, what is the meaning of planned expenditure? Answer. The expenditure incurred by the government towards financial and social services, nation building exercise, and developmental works is called planned expenditure. Twelfth question: What is the meaning of capital expenditure? Answer: Thus, money spent by the government on agriculture, industry, transport, electricity, irrigation projects, and other developmental activities. Along with creation of new assets is called capital expenditure. Thirteenth, what is the meaning of public revenue? Answer: The government collects income from the varied source to meet its expenditure. It is called public revenue. Question number fourteen: What is the meaning of revenue receipts? Answer: The income generated by the government through taxes and non-tax sources. Question number fifteen: What is meaning of tax? Answer: The money paid by the citizens without any expectation in return is called tax. Sixteen question: What is the meaning of direct tax? Answer: When the tax is paid by an individual on whom it is imposed. Question number seventeen: What is the meaning of indirect tax? If the burden of tax imposed By the government is transferable to others is called indirect tax. Next, from the business studies chapter bank transaction question number one: The Reserve Bank of India, which is known as mother of banks, all banks. Why? Answer: Because all the banking transactions in India are controlled by the RBI. 
question number 2 the term bank is derived from which word answer italian italian word banco third question what is recent development in banking industry answer post offices fourth question which institution issuing national saving certificates answer the postal bank of india question number 5 which bank accounts no restriction on the number and amount of deposits answer saving bank account question number 6 which type of bank accounts where any number of transactions can be made with the bank answer current account last question seventh question which bank account is very useful to businessman current account so nearly uh, totally 81 questions very important one marks questions uh, with solutions i given in this video definitely it will help you to prepare for your main examination if you think this video is informative kindly share among your friends and if you are new to my channel kindly subscribe and thank you